protein. Protein, 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 protein. Protein. What's up guys, Coach Frank here at the Critical Men's Compound. And in this video guys, I'm gonna to reveal to you the top five protein sources that you should be making sure that you have in your diet, in your nutrition plan. All five of them, I believe, uh, when structured and put together in uh, an intelligent way, cyclical, cycling in, cycling out, using these at certain times throughout the day. So I'm gonna tell you what each one of these uh, sources are. Um, and if you guys want, at the end of this video, we actually have a free gift. So make sure to stick around all the way till the end of today's video, guys, and I'm gonna reveal to you what this free gift is. Uh, but the best protein source, in my opinion, uh, for everybody, whether you're training for strength, training for performance, training for uh, losing fat, burning, uh, burning your metabolism. Guys, I think the number one source for protein is beef. Beef. Red meat, steak, all the different options out there. Now, in the category of, of beef and red meat, you obviously have a few different options you can look to. Uh, if you're trying to get a high protein, lean fat, you obviously want to stick with more leaner cuts or leaner ground beef. So there's a lot of uh, places you can get 90-10 lean beef, which means it's 90% lean, 10% fat. I've even seen some as, as lean as 93, 95, and 97 lean. So knowing that you're going to Primarily use red beef or uh, red meat and beef as the building blocks uh, for your protein. Um, look at getting a, 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 a lot of different options. So some leaner cuts, some sirloins, uh, uh, some fillets, great, great options there. Flank steak, great option is, is, as well. And then if you want to get to some of your, your, your fattier cuts. So maybe you saw the video that we recently shot on building muscle without carbohydrates. You're like, okay, Frank, what's a great option to get both my protein and my fat in? Something like a ribeye, something like a New York strip is gonna have a great combination of both the lean protein that you need and then obviously giving you those healthy fats. I think the first option here for everybody you can look all the way back into the 70s and 80s, the golden era. This is what Arnold and Franco and guys that trained with Vince Ronda used as a foundation for their muscle building was the beef steak. So number one is beef, guys. You need to have it in there. Beef. Number two, I think, is going to be eggs. Eggs. Just because we talked about, obviously, the need for more than just protein. We obviously want to get some fats in there. Uh, so I'm not talking about egg whites. I'm talking about the entire egg, the yolk included. So once again, you're going to get a, a high amount of protein, but obviously you're going to get some omega-6 uh, fats in there as, as, as well. You're going to get a lot of other great, great nutrients that are included in there. So beef, eggs. If you want, guys, check out Vince Ronda. He was famous for literally the steak and eggs diet. So first two, uh, first two sources, steak, red meat, beef, and eggs. <laughs> Thirdly, I think fish. Fish. And then within the fish, the category of fish, you have a few different types of fish that I think you should be including in there. Uh, so you wanna get some of your fattier cuts. So this is gonna be something like a salmon. Uh, it's gonna be great essential uh, fatty acids. Um, in addition to giving you all the all the protein that you're going to need. Now, if you're somebody that is looking at more leaner options there, this is going to get into your cods, your groupers, your halibuts, uh, your your tilapia. Not a great alternative in my opinion, but it's there for you. Uh, very, very lean cuts of meat. So we got the steak, beef, eggs, fish. Fish. Uh, next option is going to be your chicken. Sweet and sour chicken! And I think that this is where a lot of people go to as number one. I can't tell you how many people I knew, and this was me in in in, in the past as well. Like, I was the guy's like, chicken's number one. My views and opinions have changed uh, over the last couple of years. I think the ROI on four to six ounces of chicken is not the same that you get from the ROI on four to six ounces of beef. That's why I put beef as number one, because you get other nutrients, other minerals, other vitamins, other essential things in your diet that you're not gonna get from a lean chicken breast. Uh, but I do think it's still a very great food, a great source of protein. So those are all the whole food options. Steak, beef, eggs, fish, chicken. Sweet sour chicken. And then the last one, guys, if you haven't gotten all your, your macros hit, you haven't hit all your numbers uh, with the Whole Foods, you can then look at using some protein supplement. Hurry, mix, mix. So this is where something like a protein powder is going to come into play. And I think for most of us, a simple whey protein isolate is going to be the best option. Yeah, you'll look at some other options out there. You have your soy proteins, your vegan proteins, uh, your meat-based proteins all great missing certain things i think for what we're looking for here is using this as just a way to get those those last uh 
grams of, of protein in, a whey isolate is, is a great option. And guys, if you're looking to take your protein shake and supplements to the next level, I told you I had a free gift for you. So what we've done here at Critical Bench is actually put this recipe book together. This has, I don't know, there's maybe 20, maybe 30 different uh, protein shake recipes. Everything from a breakfast uh, protein smoothie to a pre-workout, to a post-workout, uh, to something later on in the night. Whether you're low carb, high carb, keto, it's all included in here. And we're actually gonna give you this book absolutely free. So if you click that link down there below in the pinned comment below, not only am I gonna send you the protein book for free, but because we have an influx of protein shakers, I'm gonna do everything I can to make sure you guys get everything you need. We're gonna give you a free shaker cup today as well. So click that first link down there. Uh, but the top five protein sources, guys, make sure you get them in your diet, make sure you cycle it in, cycle out. Don't stick with just one because it's a combination of all that's gonna get you to the next level, guys. So check it out there. Free protein shake down there in the first pinned comment below. Coach, forget the compound. I love you. We'll see you in the next one.